Okay guys, taking a break from the hood, which I'll show you all that later on because I've got more aqua resin coming this week. I've done my research and I, I know Dynomat is what everybody uses. Um, I'm going to use Kill Mat. Kill Mat is pretty much Dynomat, uh, just different name on it. I know a lot of companies out there will buy the same product and put their name on it. Um, this is 36 square feet per box. Um, I bought two boxes on Amazon for $59 a piece. Uh, so I think it'll be plenty to do what I want to do to this truck. Um, but I'm going to give you a sound. I'm going to knock on the panels. And I'm going to show you how it sounds now. And then I'm going to show you after. So we're going to do the doors, the floor, the back wall, and a ceiling. Okay? Uh, which I do have something for the ceiling later, so you'll see that. So here's the here's the door panel. Okay, the roof. Pretty hollow. Back wall and the floor. Pretty loud. So I'll cut you back on after I get some of this done and just kind of give you a comparison. Uh, if you want to listen to it again, you can just scroll back in the video and look what at this part again and then compare it to when it's put in. Uh, I know I'm doing some of this stuff out of sequence, but you know, it's what it is. I do what I can do when I have the free time of the day before products get here. So I'll cut you back on. Okay. I'm going to show you what I've done so far. I've got nine sheets left out of the one box. I've already done this much of the floor. Up this side, I've got some more to do over there. Two more sheets. I've got the back done. Um, I did my research, um, which everybody should do on any product they ever use. Don't just take anybody else's word for it because Dynamat cost, this would have cost, probably cost me about 300 and something, 350 bucks or more for Dynamat, which I'm not knocking them. They're a great product. <clears throat> I just, I kind of like to hang on to my money a little bit and spend it on something else, something else bright and shiny. Um, this is never going to be seen, but it does exactly what I want to do. I haven't done the doors yet, but I'm going to show you a little bit of sound difference here. Okay, you ready? Remember, listening to before. This is the back wall. This is the top. Much, much different. Now, we are doing something special for the top that's why I put that up there um, and for the back as well that's not even going to be seen or the top it's not going to be seen either all this is actually going to be smoothed out all the way down um, but that's it for now I just wanted to give you an update now I know that there's a lot of products on the market and there's a lot of good sound deadening heat shield just like Dynamat, just like Kill, Kill Mat, which I use Kill Mat because of the price. And the, the um, any of the, uh, you know, videos that I watched of it, it performed just like Dynamat. Now, Dynamat might be a little thicker from a couple of the videos that I watched, but this does exactly what I want. So, that's that. Um, I'm not sponsored by anybody, anything that I have ever used. Um, so I don't get any kickbacks or different prices. This was $59 a box for 36 square feet. And then I bought a rubber roller on Amazon. I got everything the next day. And this probably took me, I would say, maybe an hour. So... Any comments, questions, 
something you've used, put it in for other people to see. Um, sent, put a picture up uh, for my people on Facebook. And if you haven't subscribed or liked or hit the notification bell to see more about how we're building this, I uh, appreciate if you do that. Any, any help would be definitely appreciated. So, more coming. The radiator from nitrocool.com. If you haven't seen what I'm putting in, uh, you definitely check that out. Probably in about a week. And then my hood. Okay, don't judge it. But this is my pink insulation foam. It's definitely sandable. Uh, I'll show more of it in the next video, probably Saturday, this coming Saturday, about three days from now. Um, the stuff that I put on it is aqua resin. It does not have, it does not have the uh, cloth or the veil in it to smooth it out, and then it'll all be sanded out, and then we'll get to doing the uh, undercoating the, on this. Um, and this is definitely much, much quieter. So until until then, guys. Thanks for watching.